He looks upon the earth and makes a quake. He touches the mountains and they smoke. I will sing to the Lord as long as I live. I will praise my God as long as I last. Would that my thoughts be pleasing to him, and I will rejoice in the Lord. May the sinners vanish from the earth, and may the wicked be no more. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. The sun knows the time of its setting. You establish darkness, and it is night. How great are your works, O Lord! In wisdom you have wrought them all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and always, and forever, and ever. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. O our hope.
has made you a reflection of his light, O Gabriel. You radiate that light which you share to all the ends of the earth. It was you who announced to us the great mystery which was hidden from eternity, that the bodiless God would take flesh from a virgin's womb and come as a man to save all mankind. Wisdom, let us be. 
from the first day you made up your mind to acquire understanding and humble yourself before God, your prayer was heard. Because of it, I started out, but the prince of the kingdom of Persia stood in my way for twenty-one days, until finally Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me. I left him there with the prince of the kings of Persia, and came to make you understand what shall happen to your people in the days to come. For there is yet a vision concerning those days. While he was speaking thus to me, I fell forward and kept silent. Then something like a man's hand touched my lips. I opened my mouth and said to the one facing me, My Lord, I was seized with pangs at the vision, and I was powerless. How can my Lord's servant speak with you, my Lord? For now no strength or even breath is left in me. The one who looked like a man touched me again and strengthened me, saying, Fear not, beloved, you are safe. Take courage and be strong. When he spoke to me, I grew strong and said, Speak, my Lord, for you have strengthened me. Do you know, he asked, why I have come to you? Soon I must fight the prince of Persia again. When I leave, the prince of Greece will come. But I shall tell you what is written in the truthful book. No one supports me against all these, except Michael, your prince. Peace to you, Jesus. Let us all say our